Hey everybody, Mental Fox here. Welcome back to Fallout 76 as we play through the Wastelanders DLC. And as I predicted, uh, the game put us uh, just kind of northeast of Ripper Alley, a location that we cleared out in the last episode. And uh, you can hear from the banjo music playing that uh, we're going to have to clear it out again. Uh, it wasn't difficult to clear out last time at all, so hopefully it won't be too difficult this time either, but I am a little annoyed that I have to do it again. Uh, but oh well, you do what you gotta do in a game such as this. And like I said, it didn't take us long to get through it. So we'll clear it out here in just a moment. What's over there? I had... I hear somebody walking around, I think. But I'm not seeing them. I mean, I really don't have to clear it out again, to tell you the truth. I can just walk on by. But I just really don't like raiders. So, let's clear them out again. Add insult to injury. Just dispatch them just as easily the second time as I did the first time. Because raiders suck. And plus, I might get some more ammo out of the deal. It could happen. Uh, or duct tape at least, anyway. So yeah, we'll just take a quick look around here and see if there's anything that I want. And then we'll just be on our way. None of these guys have anything good. Usually raiders are at least good for some 5.56 ammo, but not today. Oh no. Not today. Did I loot this guy? I don't want any of that. What about you? What do you got? Okay, let's move on. What are we doing? Well, we have this quest here. Settlers are coming into Appalachia. They need to be inoculated against the Scorched Plague. I should find their leader and talk to them. We're supposed to talk to the settler leader. If we show it on the map, it is right here at this place called the Foundation, which is near the Spruce Knob Campground. We're up here. Uh, the reason that we're coming here is just simply because um, it was uh, closest to... Uh, my camp here, although there's a, an assist commander Daguerre there now, which is interesting. What's up with that? Retrieve the emergency protocols, and then I have assist commander Daguerre. Oh, well, whatever. We'll, we'll come back to her later. Uh, she has another quest for us that requires us to go to the far northwest edge of the map, and uh, I don't want to go there yet. So I figured we would just pick the next closest place to go to, and this is it. So here we go. Pretty excited to go to the Foundation and see what it's like to meet the Settlers. We're just so excited that there's NPCs in the game again. I'm just so excited. I miss that so much from Fallout 76 this past year. It's one of my favorite thing things about the Fallout games. Fallout 3, Fallout 4, Fallout New Vegas. Meeting people, talking to them, interacting with them. It's just not the same with robots. It's just not. <laughs> Not in my opinion, anyway. Let's see if there's any trouble here. There's a little bit of a roadblock here. Very quiet. Well, aside from the uh, gunplay going on in the distance there. Me and my trusty weapon here. Super mutants, no problem. It just says caution, though. There must be another one around here somewhere. Heck, he might even be on this uh, overpass here, but I don't see him. Where are you, other super mutants? Where are you? I would like to clear you out now. Oh, diseased clo glowing mutant hound. And he's dead. What do we got in here? Eh, I'll take the gunpowder. Salisbury steak. Sounds delicious. What do you have on you? Anything cool in here? Uh, a wooden crate with nothing in it and some first aid dirty water. What about you? What do you got? Five, five, six rounds. Nice. I want five, five, six rounds for my other weapon, 
This one uses 45 ammo, the other one uses 556. Five, so are we getting close to foundation? I don't know. Like a net or something hanging off of that building. Where are we? What is this place? Huntersville. Oh yes, where it all began. Where all super mutants began anyway. You know the lore, right? They emptied the FEV into the local water supply. Turned the people in the community into super mutants. Not pretty. Not pretty. Really don't plan on sticking around here. I'm just going to move on through. Uh, I'm sure you hear more super mutants walking around. That was quite a gate. Ooh, a legendary down there. He's only a one star, though. He's probably got friends. Here's some movement to my left here. Challenge complete. Reach level 85. Okay. Well, I have leveled up again, and I still haven't decided what to spend my perk points on. Oh, here movement from this side. You guys think... Oh, jeez. Boy, this guy sounds scary. Guy coming from my right. <laughs> oh man, they don't stand a chance. I hear you walking around over there, dude. Come on, stick your head out here so I can finish you off. Come on now. Come on, I ain't got time for this. Let's go. I got places to be, man. Oh, hey. Thank you. Your turn. Come on. Show yourself. Show yourself. Okay, then don't. Let's see if I care. Caps, rounds, gunpowder. What do you got? Caps, I don't want those rounds, but I will take your stim pack. Thank you. Thank you very much for the stim pack. What do you got? Caps, canned dog food. Could be dinner. Ooh, caps. Five, five, six rounds. Bonus, bonus, bonus. That's a cool sounding gate. Hey, how's it going? Hey, where's that uh, legendary dude that I took out? Remember? I killed a legendary. This is him. He has a berserker's pitchfork. I mean, I guess I'll pick it up, but... Uh, lower damage resistance increases damage dealt. Well, that's something I'm going to exchange for script. Uh, we want to go in this direction here, don't we? Yes, we do. Let's see if I could get up this mountain. Get to where it is I want to go. What was that? Uh, just a grill. Looked like somebody standing there. Alright, let's climb this hill here. Don't know if I'm going to be able to get up it, though. Looks like we might be up against a rock face. If that's the case, we'll have to go around. I th I'm thinking we're going to have to go around. Which is a bit of a bummer. An interesting icon showing up on my compass there. I guess that's the foundation icon. Walking right into the sun. Hmm. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get up here. Let's see. Well, I might be able to wind my way up here. Lots of trees. There we go. Let's get up through here this pass here. This is pretty cool. I'm thinking it's got to be pretty safe around here if there's a settler's camp around here. I like to think that they would have eliminated any enemies around. Hmm. Well, that's where I want to go. 
don't think I could get up there from here. Let's see if I can go around this way, see how this works out. It's funny, look, the, the sun is shining through those rocks. <laughs> Okay. All right, we're almost there. This is all very exciting. I'm gonna put my weapon away. They don't seem to care if you point a weapon in their face. Not that I've noticed, but let's just uh, show them that we're friendly. Quest started daily vital equipment. A daily quest. Recover Foundation's stolen equipment. Okay, well, you'd think that somebody would like tell me about that quest instead of it just showing up. Daily quest. Um, vital equipment. I have to go see Ward at Foundation. Okay, we'll go talk to Ward while we're here. This is looking pretty neat. There used to be a workbench up here. Look at my compass, look at all the people showing up on my compass there, all the dots. Got a little lookout post here, it looks like. Nobody in it. The old monorail up there. You must leave or die. You must leave or die? What's up with that? Did the raiders come up here and spray paint that on the side of the wall here? I'm thinking that's probably what has happened here. You must leave or die. They got a scorched on that spike there. Builder's nest. This is pretty neat. What's this place? We got a little maybe storage area here, I guess. Hear people talking and working. Got some stairs here that go up. Well, I mean, I've just walked on in. They don't seem to have anybody guarding the front door. Got somebody walking over there. Level 39 settler. What's going on up here? Hey, how's it going? Hey, Settler. How are you? I don't understand why we can't get a few more Sunnies to do the boring jobs. Sunnies, huh? Is that a, a robot? Evening. Evening? Okay, evening. All right. Somebody walk. Oh, okay, so there's a guard here. Okay, that's pretty cool. Hi, how are you? Those Mothman cultists give me the creeps. They're all just crazy. Mothman cultists, huh? Oh, okay. I like the sound of that. I'm getting sick of Tato's. <laughs> I know they're easy to grow, but how about a little variety? Right. Variety, right? Is that too much to ask? Hey, you want to play me a game of chess? Hey, Settler. Come over here. Play me a game of chess. Everybody just needs to do their jobs. Then this place be great. Okay. Well, it didn't let me sit down, but whatever. So there's a named person over there, Derek. Foundation and those raiders up at the crater just don't get along. They want to take everything we've worked for. Well, that's what raiders do. They suck. Hey, man, how's it going? What's up, Sunny? Sunny has everything you need. If Sunny does not have it, you did not need it. Really? Okay. Um, well, have you heard any interesting rumors, Sunny? Travelers have reported strange posters around Lewisburg. Maybe Sunny should put up a poster. Strange. My oh. turn on guard duty. I hate those late nights walking the walls. Oh man, I'm sorry to hear that. Strange posters around Lewisburg, huh? Everything will go on sale <laughs> tomorrow, so be sure to buy today at the Higher price. Oh, that makes sense. Mm, hey, have you heard any interest, interesting rumors? A wild 
ago, Sunny heard that there were problems at the Tiger water treatment plant. Hmm. So he tells me these things, and then I, I don't get a quest out of it or anything, so I don't know if I'm supposed to remember that, or if it's something that I've actually already done you before, or what. You are missing out. You should fear it. <laughs> Shop at Sunny's. Uh-huh. Shop with Sunny first, before those other Sunnies. Their products are inferior. Okay, so, um, are there more Sunnies outside Foundation? Sunny hopes not. Sunny does not need more inferior copies of itself. Two is too, too many. Okay, so who do you report to? Who collects your money? Sunny reports to Paige. All funds are turned over to Foundation. Do not attempt to steal from Sunny. <laughs> Sunny is authorized to file a complaint. Well, we wouldn't want that to happen. So, uh, tell me another rumor. Ever been to the Red Rocket Megastar? Hmm. Sunny heard that robots there have problems. Yeah, that is another quest that we did earlier in the game. Well, let's go ahead and trade with him and we see what he's got. We all know who your favorite Sunny is. You don't have to say it. Okay, well... I sell some bulk stuff, a clown outfit, uh, some ammo and weaponry, and stuff I'm not interested in. But maybe we could sell him some stuff at some point. I don't know. Let's keep looking around. You don't Yo, have a name. How you doing? Good. How you doing? Good. 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 I oh. I lost my Trade with Sunny. Sunny has what you need. Uh huh. So here's another Sunny. Hey, what's up, other Sunny? Sunny. Sells what you need to kill your enemies or your friends. Sunny <laughs> doesn't really care. Okay. Uh, how'd you get the name Sunny? Sunny stands for Simple Utility Pneumatic Network 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 System Error Human Interface Resetting Reset Complete Welcome to Sunnies. Okay. Why don't you like the other Sunnies? They are inferior copies of the real Sunny. This Sunny. Oh, okay. Uh, alright. Well, goodbye. Goodbye. And don't forget to shop at Sunnies. That's we got a little bit of a... Uh... Music going there on over there. Is only one sunny. All other sunnies are imposters. Who's talking? Who's having the conversation? I heard a conversation, but it's hard to hear over the music. Newcomers, Newcomers are making Ward nervous. Hey, buddy. Hey, how's it going? I don't know. There's Davy Taylor down there. Samuel, Derek Taylor, Elsie Taylor, Davy Taylor. Lots of Taylors. I was kind of waiting for them to stop playing before I uh, started talking to somebody else because it's a little distracting through music. Go over this way. Oh, no. Who's this? Oh, Settler? No, no, I have ruined it. It is ruined. No, it is on sale. Oh, okay. Oh, you look at this guy. need it to live. So, buy it and nah, eat it. Blood Eagles are a Sunny. dangerous offshoot of the Raiders. I don't get along with the crater. Okay, you guys can stop playing that music now. <laughs> you can stop. It'd be cool if you did. This guy's walking around with his gun out. Found the barracks here. Hey, man. 
How's it going? I hope we can set up more settlements sure. like Foundation. I've got friends out there that didn't want to come with me. Yeah, you should be careful where you aim that weapon. Jeez. Cool. Alright, so there's another guard post down there. Still playing their music. So these are the barracks. They got enough room for, what, four people to sleep in here? Surely there's more than this. Okay, you guys, I get it. You play music. Oh, there's an elevator here to Paige's office. Okay, well this must be the leader. Let's go ahead and talk to Paige. Oh, interesting. Okay, this is going to take us inside, I guess. Neat. Hopefully can't hear the music in here. Lots of people walking around in here. This is neat. It's like, is that Paige? That's Paige. Why don't I think Paige was a girl's name? Hi, Paige. Sometimes I look around and I'm amazed at what we've built here. It is pretty amazing. Well, uh, this is a little awkward. You're from one of the local vaults, right? I sure Hope am. you don't mind us settling in your neighborhood, because <laughs> we're already kind of here. And if you want to kick us out, then the answer's no. <laughs> if the walls weren't already kind of a statement to that effect. Hmm, huh, okay. Uh, where did you all come from? Or, just remember that Vault 76 was here first, we're keeping an eye on you. Or Appalachia is big, plenty of room for all of us. Nice to meet you, I hope our people can work together. Or the important thing right now is getting you inoculated against the Scorched Plague. I'd like to know where they came from. Here and there, this way and that. You understand what I'm saying. There'll be time for swapping stories when the job here is done. But oh. let's just say we like building things. There's a security to it, you know? Foundation's just the start. Okay. Um, well, I don't know, man. Um, it's nice to meet you. I hope our people can work together. Awfully polite. Guess that's as good a start as any. More than we've learned to expect at any rate. Well, the important thing right now is getting you inoculated against the Scorched Plague. Inoculated? This some kind of a scare tactic? Uh, it's real, it burns people up, makes them crazy, or you... I don't know, I was gonna say, he hasn't seen the Scorch running around? You mean those crazies with the torch skin? Those aren't just burn victims? You're saying it's from a disease? Thanks for the warning, but... You know, if I was a local on a campaign to keep people out of my neighborhood... I might say a few things, too. I'll tell you what. One of my own is a doctor, Aubrey. I sent him ahead to start up an observation camp, get the lay of things. You talk to him about this. If he's convinced, then I'm convinced, too. Deal? I don't know why I have to be so suspicious, dude. Jeez. Uh, let's see, where is this camp? How many people? Uh, south of here. Aubrey and a few hunters. About five people. All right, fine. I'll check with Aubrey. Then I'll get you. Then you all get inoculated. Assuming he agrees with you about this disease, then we'll hear you out. Hmm. Okay. Well, I didn't really think that was a very good start. I mean, I tried to be friendly to him, but he's like, well, not quite hostile, but very sus suspicious. I'm kind of busy here. Make it quick. So, um, what can you tell me about everyone? There's not too much to tell. Everyone does what they can around here. Even Davy lends a hand. <laughs> That's not to say we expect him to be self-sufficient, of course. He's a kid. <laughs> okay, and uh, what's everyone working on in Foundation right now? Plumbing. Water is a big deal. Gotta bring it in, clean it up, distribute it. Then take it away and dispose of it. You can always tell a well-run town by the quality of its plumbing and water. Okay, and what do you do around here? Well, I oversee all the construction. I'm in charge of that much, at least. This place needs to get big and safe fast. Sometimes people need a little nudge, or a little encouragement. Or sometimes just a swift kick in the pants. That's where I come in. So you're the, you're the pants kicker, I get it. 
Okay, I guess I'll see you later, Paige. We can always use more ads. All right, fine. Put me to work. I don't know. Uh, let's look around the place, because that's what I like to do. I like to look around places. It's a little conference room, it looks like, here. There's a little bed in here. Nice. Let's see if we get any dirt on this guy. Oh, here we go. Pages Journal Entry 1. <laughs> well, let's listen. Well, we've arrived. We're finally here. <laughs> it's a damn sight better than the pit. Hopefully we can make a better go of things. Now that folks won't be afraid to start families. Some of us forgot what green living things looked like after the war. The only green we saw was the poison lingering in the air of the capital when we left on the last train out of Union Station. There's so much energy to build when you finally think things might be able to last. It's a home. A real home. <laughs> finally. Alright, well, good for you, Paige. I mean, you know, I understand I'm wanting to find a place of home. Find find a place to call home. That, that all makes sense. Nothing strange about that. But, I mean, what kind of a scum am I? Hey, look, somebody's journal. Let's listen to it. <laughs> what is this? Some miscellaneous thing. I don't know what that is. He's got his eye on me. Got some kind of lab out here. We got a chemistry station where I could do a quick scrap of junk. They've hauled in a lot of equipment. Oh, here's a door. Let's open it. Got a little storage place here. I really don't need to take any of this stuff. Just want to see what's here. Actual and very real doctor, totally qualified. Remedies, chems, advice, always available. Oh, this is just a settler, nice hat. We got work to do. Always something else needs taken care of. Oh, it looks like they accept ghouls. Yes, indeed. It's okay to be scared. It means you're about to do something really freaking brave. Really? Okay. In this world, a man himself is nothing. And there ain't no world but this one. Mm okay. Lovely weather, isn't it? Yeah, it is kind of nice out there. Ah, have you seen my tools? Ah, never mind. I just spotted them. Okay, good, because I didn't see your tools. Got a bed back here. Kind of nice. It's not bad. It's not bad what they've done with this place. Looking around to see if I see any more tapes to pick up and listen to. Any terminals to hack into. Restricted access, it says. Well, that didn't stop me. Restricted area, keep out. Oh, okay. Interesting. Alright. Somebody with the broom. Hey, what's up, settler? How's it going, man? How's it going? Good. I, I, how are you doing? I've met a lot of friends here in Foundation. Nobody special yet, though. If you know what I mean. Oh, I do. Good luck with that. Quit looking at me. Look at this guy. <laughs> You're kind of creeping me out, dude. <laughs> He's watching us, man. <laughs> Every move we make, he is watching us. Oh, wow, look at that. What is going on down here? What is this place? Neat. Wow. They have a lot of stuff. Is this some kind of power generator, maybe? Hey, how's it Whoa. going? Everyone can see you're on chems. What? Go sleep it off. I'm not on chems? What are you talking about? Why did she think I'm on chems? Is it because I'm on Radaway still? Waste lad? What the hell's waste lad? Yeah? I, I don't know what that is. Did I take something? I don't remember taking anything. That's really weird that she said that. Sonny always says his stuff will go on sale tomorrow. Somehow, tomorrow never seems to get here. Mm-hmm. That's sunny, I tell you. What's going on here? <laughs> Why do I think this is so interesting? I mean, it's really not, is it? But, I don't know, there's just something really interesting about it. I love it. 
This is really neat. I heard Sonny got a new shipment in. Yeah? I've got to go check it out. Go on, man. Don't let me stop you. Let's see what's going on in here. Ooh, neat looking place they got here. Yeah, they got some beds in here. They got a desk where they could do some work. A little table to have a have a lunch. Got a TV here. Don't know what they're watching. I don't know. I think there's any TV stations. Here's some uh, dog tags on the ground there. Got a beds. More beds. Ironing board. This is great. I'm just getting the biggest kick out of this. Okay, that'll take us down. This will take us over here. Down to this. Should have built that house long ago. Forager? Is that your name or is that what you are? Hey, dude, how's it going? Whoa, don't walk away from me. We all got a toot. It's normal, kid. <laughs> we all got a toot. It's normal, kid. You seem like somebody who appreciates resourcefulness. I know, I know, you're thinking. I've seen you before, right? You recognize this mug, don't you? Uh. Hmm. Well, if we had higher luck, we could say, uh, you're a famous author. Oh, I'm sore all over. Building this place up is hard work. Okay, man. Uh, if we had a better reputation with the settlers, we could say, I think Paige mentioned you. You're an author, right? Or say, nope, not even, not even slightly sorry. I don't know, maybe. We could use our charisma and say, I apologize for my ignorance, but I would like to know who you are. Or intelligence. Oh, you're that author. I saw your book cover. Yeah, let's say that. Let's flatter the guy. Bingo! We have a winner here, kids. Will you look at that? Somebody knows me. I knew it would happen. Ever since the war, I've been sort of scrabbling along, thinking of my books, making the best. I have enough time to write some more, and that's exactly what I aim to do. But, in order to do that, I need a place to stay for a bit. And, mm. if you have a place, well, I would be happy to watch it for you. To tell you some stories, I'm a wealth of practical knowledge, kid. Oh, golly gee, sir. I'm, I'm all filled up. Sorry, I'm gonna have to pass. I guess. Not everybody's got a decent place ready for guests. It's not what I said at all. So my understanding is that you can only have one... I'd gladly oh. walk up a hill in the snow if it means not eating from a garbage can again. Okay, yeah, me too. Uh, my understanding is you can only have... You can only, like, be doing quests for one, um... I don't know, guest at a time. I just need to rest my So eyes. we'll come back to him. I'll try to remember That's him. Come back to him, and after we're done with uh, Daguerre's stuff, we'll check with him. Settler here. You're up late. Am I? Is it late? I don't know, man. You're up too. This is really nice down here. Hey, how's it going? Boy, I guess these hats are in fashion. What are you doing up this late? What Go the? Get some shut -eye. Okay, I guess it's nighttime. If we can get the flock big enough. We can add chicken to the menu. Oh, that sounds delicious. Oh, chicken. Yeah, chicken. Chicken. Oh, I really like what they've done here. This is Always great. Wanted to retire in the forest yeah? Okay, cool. This is neat. Just looking around. Seeing what else there is to see. Never mind. Huh. Where was I? Oh, okay. This is probably uh, highlighting the button on the elevator for me to get out of here. Settler. I just want to make sure there's no more named people down here that I should be talking with. Doesn't look like it. Oh, I was going to say, did you hear? Oh, Jen. Okay. Well, there's somebody. Hey, wake up. I want to talk to you. What's up, Buttercup? Huh. So, uh, where'd y'all come from? Oh, I joined up with them north of here a while back. They seem to be from all over this region. My family used to live in what's now the Capital Wasteland. Oh, interesting. What do you do around here besides sleep? Mostly, I keep an eye on the area around Foundation. I look for good things to bring back and keep an eye out for anything hazardous. If the super mutants are on the move or a bunch of scorched move into the area, Ward needs to know as soon as possible. Okay. 
Bye. See you around. Nice talking to you, Jen. I'll let you get back to sleep. I've heard good things about you. Really? Hopefully we can go on a scavenging run sometime. Well, I would love that. Let's go now. What's up, Buttercup? No, I guess not now. Okay. See you around. I like her shirt, Nuka World. That's cool. Whoa, did you see that spinge move she just did? <laughs> I get that some of the folks here are really afraid of the Scorch Beast. But for me, it's the giant ugly toads. Ugh! <laughs> They're pretty ugly, all right. I'll give you that. All right. I do believe that is everybody there is to meet with and speak with down here. So let's go ahead and take the elevator back up. Back up to Appalachia. So that's really neat that they built that whole underground place there. That seems like a pretty sa safe place. Yeah, I like what they're doing here. The raiders are going to have to work awfully hard to impress me. Because this is really impressive what they've done here. So we're going to go up here and we're going to talk to this ward guy about this deal. Oh, goody, they're still playing the music. Oh, they stopped. Good. <laughs> Civilization is being rebuilt right here in Foundation. Oh, yeah? Do you not have a name? Uh, Underground HQ, main elevator, guest rooms. This guy doesn't have a name. Interesting. I can't interact with him. I'm not even crouched. Okay. Uh, so here's a gold press machine. I really go for a hoagie. Ooh, hoagie. Sandwich. Yeah, I know what a hoagie is. It sounds delicious. Uh, gold press machine. My I have nothing to turn in here. So my understanding is that this is a new form of currency here in Wastelanders. So be interesting to see how that plays out. My little guy's thirsty, so let's go ahead and give him some what the food. Heck is a John, anyway. I just don't get it. <laughs> what the heck is a John, anyway? What did he say? What did he say? Cajun rice and beans. Uh, carrot soup. I don't. That'll give me a little bit of food. A little bit of water too. Just looking for stuff to see if anything's about ready to spoil. Glowing meat steak. Yeah, sure, whatever. Is it yins or yous or y'all? I can't keep up. <laughs> uh, okay. So we're gonna go over here and talk to this ward guy about some equipment that's missing. I believe How you doing, ward? he's probably sleeping. scavenging runs. There's lots of stuff out there if we can only get to it before the others. Yeah. Let me know if you need a break. Yeah, do you need a... Don't go to bed. No, no, no. Finally, someone with the guts to help. When we went to get our intrusion module, it was gone. We think it was taken by a thief. If you can get it back, we'd be very grateful. Grateful enough to pay you. Really? Um... I mean, sure, it sounds right up my alley, man. Excellent. Fortunately, you put tracking transmitters into the really sensitive stuff like that. I can show you roughly where it is, but you'll have to wait until you're closer to get an exact fix on it. Okay. All right. So the deal with this is, is that this is a daily the quest. The recover a missing equipment, the better. Oh, okay, jeez. Give me one second, dude. Damn. Uh, so this is a daily quest. Um, which I'm assuming means that if I exit the game and come back, this quest will no longer be available. So, um, let me go into my quests here. We're going to turn off the other quests so that this is the only quest selected. And, uh, we are going to see if we can't retrieve this for this guy sooner rather than later. Let's go do it, man. Let's go. Let's see if we can get this. Let's get right on it, man. We're gonna get within tracking range of this thing. I'm gonna run over there because we're really eager to help this guy out. He seemed like he really needed help right away. So we're gonna we're gonna see if we can't get to this thing really quickly. Kind of far down, huh? It's probably further than I want to drop. I hate to take the time to run all the way around. This might work. Yeah, this will work. 
Okay, let's go. I'm so excited. Let's go get this thing for this guy. We want we want the people in the foundation to like us. Are we there yet? Whoa, what the hell? Wait a minute. That's weird when I looked at this before. Oh, that's Aubrey. Oh, geez, this is a lot further away than I thought. Oh, hell. Huh. Okay. I didn't know that. Let's go to my camp and go from there. Hmm. I, um... Yeah. Alright. When I looked at the circle before, I guess I was looking at Aubrey. Aw, oh, damn it. Oh, darn it, game. Shoot. Why do you keep putting me here? Doggone it. Um... Let's go here. I need. I guess I need to move my camp, because it keeps putting me in that location. Not my camp, but, you know, the little box that says camp. Man, that's a bummer. I mean, thankfully, I'm my camp is close to a fast travel point. Okay, so I'm going to move this thing. Um, modify, move. We're going to put it... Um, Right here, which is where I had it before, I think. And then we'll see if when I fast travel here, if it doesn't start putting me someplace different. Instead of down below where I can't do anything. Okay, let's go, man. So I think I'm going to have to put on my power armor suit to drop down from here. And this isn't that far, we'll be alright. That's pretty far down. Let's go down this way, we'll be alright. I'm very excited to do this. Who knows what we're gonna come across out here? Huh, there's a new icon there on my compass. Looks like a raider camp. See it right there in the center of my compass? Something in that direction. <sighs> Got to be getting close. So whoever stole this thing took it way over here. Okay, we're getting close. Not sure what I'm going to find here. Gotta be raiders or something, right? Hmm. So, we've got this... Use the Foundation Property Tracker radio station to find the stolen property. Is that what I'm supposed to be doing? They optionally convince the thief to pay for the property. I bet you it's up here. Caution. Can we get closer or not? Look at this place. What the hell is this place? I'm getting further away, aren't I? Course finish. What the hell? Am I getting closer or further away? Oh, this is this place. Huh. Danger. Whoa. Don't shoot at me. Crap, man, I don't know where to go. Fifty-two percent. Getting closer. 
Lots of scorched around here. Oh man, I want to get on top of that building. We're getting closer. Closer. These gunshots we hear might be this person trying to fight off scorched. Yep, I think. Getting closer. Almost there. He's in here. Oh, he's dead. Well, I guess we're not going to convince him to return it then, are we? Stupid raiders. Taking your module, you jerk. It's not even your module, it's my module. Hey, 45 rounds, cool. Nice. <laughs> Vest. Yeah, we, we've been here before. We, we already looked through all this. Okay, cool. So now we've got the item on our daily quest here. I've recovered the stolen equi equipment for Ward. Okay. So, I don't see any reason why we wouldn't fast travel back here. So let's just fast travel back here and give this to Ward and um, finish off this daily quest. He said he was willing to pay for it. So we'll see what he's going to pay us. This is all very exciting. Hm. It's interesting, for a moment there, there was an option to convince the guy to give it back, but I haven't come across many raiders that I could actually have a conversation with, so I'm not sure how that would have worked out had he not been dead. Guess we'll find out at some point, maybe, I don't know. Hey, hey, how's it going? Sorry, no time to chat. Okay, yeah, you look like you're busy. Foundation and those raiders up at the crater just don't get along. They want to take everything we've worked for. Over here. Here we go. I think. Yeah, in here. Okay, cool. Alright, dude. Man, were we gone all night? Get up, dude. Wake up. I got your thingy. Oh, man, don't hit your head. I see you have our missing property. I do. I had to kill them to get it. I hope it was worth it. Or piece of cake. They never knew what hit them. Or, uh, glad to help. I'm donating my reward to Foundation. Let's get a good reputation with these people. Let's donate our reward. You are? That's very generous. Foundation thanks you. I'll get this intrusion. What the? Okay. Never mind. Current standing is still cautious, though. I suppose I've it's... got my eye on <laughs> you. No offense. Hey, is there anything else I could do for you? Foundation is a good place. Someday... It'll be a great place. Okay, so, um, tell me about other people. I'm not a gossip. Wasted time running your mouth about other people's problems. But I can tell you that the Taylors are good people. Derek is a fine carpenter. And Elsie knows how to handle herself in a fight. Okay. I heard you're one of the leaders here. Me? Nah. I'm no more in charge than one of the turrets. I'm just a guy that works hard. When I see something that needs to get done, I do it. I haven't earned the right to be thought of as a leader. Not with my background. Um, care to expand on that? How'd you end up in the at Foundation? The long, hard way. I'm ashamed to admit that I used to be a raider back when I was young. You should be That's ashamed. a hard life. And it took its toll on me. I began to question the purpose of what I was doing. There wasn't any. I guess... Maturity comes with age. Now I want a better place for everyone, not just me. Okay, well, nice talking to you, Ward. I'm keeping my eye on you. Most folks here need a hand with something. Reach out. All right, well, cool. Well, maybe I'll reach out in the next episode because uh, it's time for me to end this episode. I'm sure he won't mind if I crawl into his bed. Oh, I actually meant it to get on the top bunk, not the bottom. Bunk. <laughs> Sorry, dude. I'm gonna take your bed. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alright, end this episode here when we come back next time. Uh, we'll probably head down and uh, look for Aubrey, that doctor, to see if we can convince her 
uh, about the importance of inoculating everybody here at Foundation. So excited to see more of the story. I hope you are too. I hope you had fun today. If you did, why don't you let me know? Leave me a like or a comment. Thanks for watching. See you next time.